Fitting a drawer to its opening involves hand planing. And with a bit of foresight, you can construct the drawer in such a way that it's easier to plane and also ensure a perfect fit. Now the key to a sweet fitting drawer is the front. If it fits the opening perfectly, then the drawer will too, provided that the sides are flush with the ingrain. First, square up one end of the front. I like to use my shooting board for this. Then, do the same to the other end and continue trimming until the front's length is spot on. Now, move on to the bottom edge, planing it straight and smooth. Finally, plane the top edge until the front fits in the opening with some space for expansion. That's a great fit. Now let's turn our attention to the back and the sides. With the sides, grain orientation is very important. And that's because after you've assembled the drawer, you'll want to plane from front to back so that you don't blow out the front edge. That means your grain needs to run from front to back on the sides. It's easy to do that before you've cut the grooves. And when it comes time to lay out and cut the dovetail joinery, you want to start by setting your marking gauge so that it's slightly less than the thickness of your sides. Then, when you cut the baseline on your drawer front, you end up with sides that are actually a little bit proud of the ingrain. Now comes the tricky part. You've got to plane this glued up drawer so it fits into the opening. If you've got a traditional vise with one screw and two guide posts, you can use the guide post to support the drawer during planing. Here's how. Put a support block on edge atop the guide post. Put the drawer on top of it and then clamp the drawer in place. With the drawer held securely, now I can plane with confidence. Perfect fit.